at 11, a Silicon Valley legend has a massive new project underway, and some South Bay residents may have already gotten a sneak peek. A giant airship is getting ready for testing at Moffett Field. ABC 7 News South Bay reporter Lauren Martinez has the story. The news is out about a massive airship getting ready to take flight over the Bay Area. Its current home is inside Hangar 1 at Moffett Field in Mountain View. Well, first, I'm glad to see the hangar at Moffett being used for something other than just the air, because uh, those are historic and very important, I think. Secondly, uh, I'm delighted to see somebody working diligently on another rigid airship. This thing looks like a Goodyear blimp on steroids. It's actually double the size of the Goodyear blimp. Its name is Pathfinder 1. It's 400 feet long and 66 feet wide. Google co-founder Sergey Brin's company, LTA Research, which stands for lighter than air, is behind this prototype electric airship. We are in a revolution in uh, aviation, aerospace, and all ways going to electric as fast as we can. The Pathfinder 1 has 12 electric motors, computerized flight control, and 13 helium bags to provide lift. The size of this alone tells me that uh, there's new technology involved in the very structure. Uh, this is not a Hindenburg, uh, not only in terms of using helium instead of flammable hydrogen, but also in terms of using uh, uh, carbon technology as much as possible to keep the weight of the very structure down. Just last week, Pathfinder 1 began outdoor testing. In the coming weeks, South Bay residents could see it take flight too. LTA Research released this statement to ABC7. In the coming months, Pathfinder 1 will undergo both masted and free flight testing at Moffett Federal Airfield, led by our team of certified airship pilots and experienced ground crew. I've had a chance to tour the base and see that big hangar and uh, was even told recently that uh, something sneaky is going, going on in there. Glad to find out what it is. LTA says their mission is to speed up humanitarian aid. The hope is they can reduce the carbon footprint of aviation in the future. In the South Bay, Lauren Martinez, ABC 7 News.